is a story called Rabbit Plays Tug of War. And it is an old Indian folk tale that's been passed down by the Creek tribe and many other tribes. Once upon a time, there was a rabbit. Hey, you know, she's talking about me here. Me, and I'm really, really important. I'm very important to this story. That's right. But are you going to let me tell the story? All right. Anyway, this rabbit loved to run races. He ran races all day long. And I was the fastest. I was really, really the fastest. The fastest. Nobody could catch me. Nobody at all. I ran all day long. I beat the foxes. And I beat the beavers. I could run faster than anyone. But by noon, the rabbit was very, very thirsty. And so he decided he would go to shh. Don't tell him. It's a secret. Nobody knows about my favorite place to go get a drink. Nobody. Nobody knows. Oh, but it's a really good secret. We'll tell it really kind of quiet so they don't know and they don't spread it. Just don't tell anybody, okay? Anyway, Rabbit loved to go to the cold, cold place in the river right in the center right below where the river bent to the north and where the river bent down to the south. Yeah, because that's where the water's the freshest and the coolest and the most delicious and it tastes so, so good. Uh, but, well, that's true. Are you going to tell him or am I? You better. I don't like to talk about it. At the top of the curve of the bend of that river, as you go north, in the slime and the mud, sat an old, old snake. And that old, old snake didn't let anybody drink from his part of the river. That's true. He did. <laughs> And down at the south part of the river, where it bent down to the south, down in the weeds and the mire was a crabby snake. And that crabby snake didn't let anybody get drinks from his part of the river either. Yeah, he was pretty mean. So one day, Rabbit got an idea. And he got a big, long vine, really, really, really long. And he went up and he said to that old, old snake, uh, Mr. Snake? Yeah? What do you want for a ball? Well, I'm really, really, really thirsty. Well, you think you're going to get a river and drink in my river? <coughs> I don't think so. Well, um, I guess what? I'm really strong, too. I think I could pull you in the river. What? I do. I think I'm so strong, Mr. Snake, that this is what I could do. If you hold this end of the grapevine in your mouth, and when I say, on your mark, it's that pull, if you pull and I pull, I think I'll pull you in the river. And if I do, can I have my drink? If you can pull me in the river for a ball, you can have all the water you want. Said the snake, because he knew it never, ever happened. Now then the rabbit took the other end of that grapevine, and he went down, 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 around to the south bend of the river. And he said, Mr. Snake? Yeah, that's me! What do you want, hairbrain? Well, Mr. Snake, I'm really thirsty. Well, you better go to another river. You're not getting a drink from my river. Well, I understand that, but I thought I would just challenge you and, and we'll just see. You know, not only am I the, the fastest... I know, you've been running all morning chasing all the animals, acting like you're the best. Well, I know, but, um, well, I'm also the strongest. You and who else? I am. I'll tell you what. You hold this vine.
line in your mouth and you just hold it in your mouth like that and I'll hold the other end over here and when I say on your mark it's at pull we'll pull and when I pull you in the river then I can have my drink said the snake whose mouth was now very full of that line so now the rabbit went over into the vine, into the reeds by the river, and he sat down. And he waited, and he said, On your mark, get set. Oh, wait, i got to relax here a little bit. Okay, I'm relaxed. Pull! Now that growled old snake, he started to pull, and he pulled, 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 and he pulled. And, he pulled, and, he pulled. and that crabby old snake. Well, he began to come out of the water river a little bit, and he couldn't believe it. Whoa! That rabbit's struggling a slot. I better pull harder. And started to pull, 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 pull. Now that old, old snake, soon he was coming out of the water. Whoa! Whoa! That furball really got strong. I gotta use better muscles. And so he started to pull, 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 pull. And soon he pulled Mr. Crabby Old Snake up, and he was moving toward the river. Now those snakes pulled back and forth and back and forth, and they pulled and they pulled and they pulled. And pretty soon, Rabbit began to snicker. Because <laughs> it was pretty funny, watching those snakes pull and thinking I was pulling on the other end. And then he began to laugh harder. <laughs> Be quiet. Those snakes will hear me. <laughs> Rabbit! Said both of those snakes at the same time. Yeah? Get out here! Uh, I'm not so hungry anymore. I'm not so thirsty either. I, I'll just go home. Goodbye, bye. Goodbye, goodbye, uh, goodbye. Get back here! Oh, uh, alright. Okay. But, um... Rabbit! You may not play tricks on us like this anymore. You are never welcome to get a drink from this river. We know you are not strong. You may be fast, but you are not the strongest or the smartest. And from now on, you will have to drink from puddles. You will never be able to drink from the river again. Okay, all right. As long as, long as you just don't, don't, don't um, give me any poison or, you know, you don't bite me or anything. Oh, okay, all right, all right, all right. I learned my lesson. But that isn't quite the end of the story. <laughs> Rabbit had the last laugh. Because from that day on, any time Rabbit wanted a drink, are you going to tell him? I think we better... Any time I want to drink, I just transform myself into a baby deer. And then I got to drink really fast. And that's why. That's why you never see a rabbit get a drink from a river. You might see a baby deer, but you never see a rabbit get a drink from a river. <laughs> Ever. Ever at all. And that is the way that the Native Americans explained why we never see rabbits get drinks from the river anymore.